Well, I just went on ahead and popped on my energy converted eternal war buff, so we can go ahead and have some fun. First off, let's go ahead and just see. Look at all these crits. We got orange crits, sometimes red crits. This is all thanks to Blood Rush and my Smita Kavat, which is now kicking in, I believe. Or is that just Blood Rush? Actually, no, it's probably just Blood Rush still. When I see red crits, that's when the Smita is kicking in. Yeah, for now it's still Blood Rush. So the Smita's giving me another buff right now, it's a different one. Oh boy. I'm gonna go back. Okay, you can just chill over here. Chill right here for now. For now, now, now. So yeah, like, this attack speed is definitely really nice, and I can still control the different combos if I truly want to. Though, there's one that's the most efficient for mobility, which I want to keep. So I normally just do that one plus the slide attacks just to keep my mobility up. So, it's mostly just one main combo plus slide attacks. That's how I just stay mobile. You know? Because, like, at the end of the day, you want to be able to, like, change corners and follow all the targets as fast as possible to keep your combo multiplier going. Hence why I also play with a higher mouse sensitivity, because I can make much more acute movements like that <laughs> so eh, I don't know this Nox is just gonna die instantly like that because I also have weeping wounds plus condition overload on this so it's a weeping wounds condition overload plus br um not berserker plus blood rush and prime reach <laughs> can't forget that because as you just saw I, I killed a Nox to the wall and like literally a second or two so that's how that was possible because the prime reach gave me prime reach gave me that range prime reach is just like oh he's through a wall no problem let me just let me just reach on through that real quick <laughs> like what so it's like yeah so i hit him with a sword through the wall with us but the wall itself has no damage okay yep tote tote makes sense totes you know, we should just try and keep this combo multi up, actually. So we'll just do that. <laughs> we'll just, like, literally camp right by their base. Because when you camp by their base, you get the chance of maintaining your combo multiplier Um, in this. As long as the middle part doesn't go down. You know, like, the little platform. As long as that doesn't go down, then your drifting contact, or um, even be better in terms of combo duration, would be body count. You know, you can also use that, of course, and you just have your cow multiplier duration increase, so like, during the waves, between the waves, it doesn't go down, you have to like reset those and like try and build it back up, it's just there and ready to go. So I'm already at three times, so never my Smita kicks in, it'll just be red crits for that specific, um, for that specific buff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go for this guy in a second. Hold on. There you go. There you go, bud. And now uh, you need a revive, no prob, bud. Don't worry, I'll carry. I'll, I'll carry, man. That's what we gotta do. That's what Valk does. That's what this build in particular does, guy. Yeah, it carries. Now let's keep this combo multi, please. Damn it, it's going down, so it's gonna run out. I had a feeling that was gonna happen. Yeah, a couple of quick thinking. To be careful about taking all that notify that I didn't lose my buff though, you know? This melee attack speed is absolutely ridiculous. 
when I say ridiculous, like, do you understand? Are you witnessing what I'm witnessing right now? This is freaking retarded. And it's like, damn, son. The stereo just one shots like everything. Not surprising though. Oh my gosh, there is the Smita buff coming in, guys. And now you can see it in all its glory. Check this shit out. It's absolutely ridiculous. The Red Crit Fury. Everywhere you go. You wanna try it with Hysteria now? You wanna you wanna red crit with some hysteria? Will it work? Nah, I need the other I need the multiplier from this. Oh, it's already over. Okay, that was fair enough though. We had a we had a good use out of it. <laughs> we got some fair usage out of that speed up buff, so we'll 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 be happy. It was fun while it lasted, you know? Damn, son, those red crits though. Okay, get your eyes back here. Thank you. Are you gonna continue going even more? Nah, he's probably not gonna do that. I'd be down, of course, but I don't know. Huh. All right, we'll just take that Kavasa Prime Band. This guy wants to dip, bro. Motherfucker. <laughs> he wants to go. Bro, I still need a more mastery, man. I was ready to go for a while. I was using my melee. So, I don't get a lot of affinity for other weapons. Hmm. Okay, let's just bring this guy to my dojo real quick. And you get that plat. The only reason why I'm selling it to him is because, like, I have a couple. So. I can do that. That's my prob. You can go ahead and. Well. Get an extra copy. That's like your dojo or mine, buddy. I already brought you to my dojo. Freaking silly. What the fuck just happened? I just got teleported to his dojo. I guess we're gonna have to use his. That's so random. Random as fuck. I think I thought I was already in. I thought they were already here. Mine. Hmm. Hmm. This one is that drain. This one is that drain. This one is that drain. He'll be smarter if you take, give him this one because this one is lower. So in case if this is too much and that's too much, I can still use this. So. There you go. I got a bunch of trains left, so it's all good. No problemo. We just got a Vectus Prime receiver earlier, so like, he's easily giving me money. You know what I mean? Like, off of the intact relic that he dropped earlier. And we got that Vectus Prime receiver, which is worth like, I don't even know how much plat, but I know it's worth a little bit something good. Let's go check it out real quick. Um, what are you looking for? Alright, let's go ahead and search that on up. And I'll also let you guys see what I'm seeing. So, met this Prime Receiver Warframe Market. We are looking at, oh my goodness, that's worth over 100 platinum. What the fuck? I didn't know that was, I thought it was like maybe like 60. Okay. Okay, guys, so like, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm doing something a little bit different. We can do like this. So, yeah, like, that's crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Damn.
damn son that that is great I'm gonna take that so a hundred platinum is what I can list this one at he's listing as 120 I could probably list mine like one 110 115 and just wait for someone to come by it oh I'm not even signed in Ripperoni Rippin peace Rippin peace do I have to oh I have to do all this bullshit okay you know what we'll do that we'll do that after the video okay I thought it was gonna be a quicker process than this but it's not okay that's what they're telling me right now at least <laughs> so we're gonna have to leave that as is but yeah guys so that was Valk here just having some fun of course I gotta show you guys the build I was using so here you go this is the build check her own out right over here guys so 229% power strength and 155% duration 50% efficiency and 100% range now that is the build which I was using for just this however for like other things you could also change that up and go with a transient fortitude and a streamline which is also pretty nice which I was using for before but if you want to use more hysteria if you want to use more hysteria this one works just fine as well 128% duration 130% efficiency you still have the power strength there because you have energy conversion either way so you're still going up to 255% power strength because you're adding 50% of, of 170% so that's really good and the duration is still pretty decent you have that plus eternal war which increases the um, duration of war cry for two seconds for each time you kill someone melee so that's good you have your hunter adrenaline prime flow is absolutely unnecessary with your hunter adrenaline there because you just have his 30 to life steal back and you have so much armor that you can tank pretty much everything that comes your way so y you don't really need prime flow on her unless you're truly going for like a hysteria only build then you can maybe put that over like I don't even know I don't even know maybe streamline if you really wanted to but that doesn't help too much cuz like uh, nah, you'd rather just recast your hysteria once you're at around like 80 percent like at most you're not gonna want to pass that at any point cuz like that uh, at that point you're just like burning too much energy per power that you're getting because you already have a high enough multiplier once you start just killing things like as soon as you hit like 20 percent you'd be at a two two point five on the on the brink of like hitting a 2.5x multiplier so like you'd be better off with streamline to help everything else in general just cast easier and the initial um drain per second with hysteria just be better so if you want to do it that way you could it's either just go negative efficiency or positive efficiency there's no like like I, I wouldn't really go at neutral in this case like neutral efficiency doesn't really help Valkyrie too much it really doesn't do anything like you might as well do something else so I'm trying to think what would I want to do for now for now um, I think I'll stick with the full negative efficiency I also have another blind rage over here which is a little bit different but I'm just gonna go as I said like all the way and then put the auger secrets too for even more power strength which is just is just ridiculous I could add some more duration but this absolutely unnecessary like it is with prime continuity that's just fine um so yeah that's the build guys it's, it's pretty damn solid I'm happy with it and this needs some more affinity so I'll do something else soon time and that being said thanks for watching again hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel and I shall see you guys in my next video peace out youtubers